most of the beachgoers are still on the beach. We have a rough season continuing through Monday, and we also have uh, choppy conditions, especially in uh, those uh, sheltered areas. It will be particularly rough along the northern and eastern coastlines all the way through Tuesday, possibly through Wednesday as well. Choppy in those sheltered areas, offshore waves nearing four meters through the Caribbean, getting up to three meters at times. That's all courtesy of uh, the strong breezes out there in the Atlantic, racing up to 50 kilometers at times, pushing in uh, those uh, waves and that will continue as we go through Tuesday. You can just see here, for the most part, all of those are small patches of cloud being pushed in on those are brisk winds. So that you notice that along the windward sides of Tobago, that's where you see a lot more of the cloudiness, and therefore a few of those are brief showers coming through overnight. But overall, it should be a calm night for those of you along those eastern areas. But down towards the Trinidad as well, looking for most western areas to stay mostly settled. A few showers are possible along the eastern side through Toco, Valencia, out towards Beach, and along the hillsides as well. That's all courtesy of the breeze. That breeze will continue to push a few of those showers and clouds as far as into Arima, and then eventually you could be seeing a few showers popping up during the day for Dili Martin, Maraval, and around the foothills of Port of Spain. For Trinidad in the southern areas, looking for windy conditions through Rio Claro, down towards Guayaguay, along the Columbus channel through Maruga as well and obviously we've been talking about uh, the fact that with the breeze it could also feel quite pleasant at times possibly no higher than a 30 degrees Celsius in Tobago 31 degrees Celsius in Trinidad possibly getting up to 32 in the port of Spain but for the rest of the week in Tobago very little is set to change as you go through Thursday and Friday similarly for Trinidad not much in terms of uh, the uh, cloudiness but you will see those uh, brief showers are coming through and all the while it will be feeling quite windy so for small craft operators, sea bathers, you are to exercise extreme caution over the next few days, all courtesy of the rough seas set to continue as you go through Wednesday, possibly through Thursday. You could be seeing some easing of those seas by the time we get to the weekend, but still nearing four meters out in the Atlantic, so be extremely careful there. And for those of you looking to travel further across the Caribbean, across the Greater Antilles, it's also quite windy here for Haiti, Port-au-Prince, as well as Kingston in Jamaica, for Antigua and most of the Leeward Islands, there will also be windy conditions with a stiff breeze for rippling the flags down there. And up towards uh, Guyana, down towards uh, Georgetown in particular, along the coastline, could be seeing a bit more cloudiness and some showers with highs of 30 degrees Celsius there. And that's basically how it will stay until Wednesday. So that's your weather and that's it from me.